You know, just a good bounce back win for us. Um, getting ready to get on the road tomorrow. Uh, you know, needed a win against a good team. We got it. Alex Phillips came out and kind of pitched the way he pitched in the fall. And uh, just spotting his fastball on both sides of the plate. A few change ups to the lefties every now and then. And kind of throwing a breaking ball uh, around the plate for a strike. And, uh, you know, gave us six good innings against a good hitting team. And then we just tried to get some guys some work. So it was a good it was a good game for us. Everything was just the way we wanted it. You know, bottom line, we got the win. Looks like y'all were first pitch swinging a couple times and spoon and banal back to back there. And yeah, the it was. Uh, you know, basically he was throwing a lot of fastballs and he he was getting it up in the zone a little bit, belt high, sometimes a little bit higher, and uh, he was trying to get ahead of us with that pitch. And we just said, hey, let's go hit it, and they they did a good job. Any report on Baxendale? Yeah, I mean, it's not broke. Um, it's bruised all over the top of his hand, fingers. Um, he, he's going on the trip with us. Uh, he wasn't available tonight, but we're thinking he might be ready to maybe swing the bat by Saturday, maybe Friday, but I'm guessing Saturday. So hopefully that'll be the way it, you know, he can keep working on it. He'll be with us, and they'll keep working him and icing him and doing whatever they're doing to try to get it ready. So, But he'll be all right. Max, if he's staying home. Yeah. You've uh, touched on a little bit, but having Spoon in the leadoff spot, what do you think that's done? For well, I, to me, you know, he, he's a good leadoff hitter. He's got, you know, he's done a good job, but it gives us, you know, if we get the end of the order on, it's kind of like get an RBI guy there. And, uh, you know, it's not like we're trying to hide him or anything, but he uh, he's come through with some big hits, maybe that, you know, that second, third time through driving a run. You know, and he's got a knack for that a little bit. You know, obviously he hit in the middle of the order. He's hit lead off. So, you know, we've been scoring more runs. So I'm just going to leave it the way it is. So you're going to go Killian and, and then Beeks down there? Just yeah. To... Same order as last time. Just that's what we did against South Carolina. And we played pretty good. So we thought, hey, let's just go with it again. See a little bit of something out of Wise at the plate today. Yeah, he hit three balls on the nose, got two hits. Safety bunt for an RBI. He had a good night, smiling a little bit. That was good to see. Uh, you know, this game is a lot about confidence, and uh, I think he gained a little bit today. So that was good to see. You know, he bounced back because he was he was pretty sick the last few days. Is the LSU, um, you know, the kind of good team? You know, uh, a lot of left-handed hitters in the lineup. Three outfielders that can really run. Um, you know, last year they had a lot of pop. This year they're gonna they try to do things. They're gonna like to hit and run and bunt and the ball gets in there in the outfield, they got a good chance of running it down. It's supposed to be warm down there all weekend, play a night game and turn around and play a noon game on T V. So um, you know, it's uh you know, it's just a weekend you just go down and play. It's like every weekend, you know. Uh Friday night starter Nola has been incredible his whole career there really. The last two years he's been almost unstoppable. So, you know, we've got our hands full and uh you know, we have to play a great game if we're going to beat them on Friday. You guys are kind of bunched up. I think they're half a game ahead of you guys in the, in the standings in the last. Uh, just yeah, you know, and uh, I haven't looked at the standings. Well, they have the same amount of wins, one less loss. And a tie, yeah. Yeah, so, you know, it, it's it's a big series like they all are. I mean, this is, I guess this is the last series of the first half. So, you know, we'll be at the halfway point on Sunday. Do you feel pretty confident with what your offense is doing? I mean, you guys scored 27 runs over the last four games. Well, to me, it's getting better. It's starting to warm up. Guys are, you know, it's usually what happens. Guys start getting a little bit of confidence, and uh, wind starts blowing out at most parks, and little, you know, things happen. So it be a great time to keep scoring runs, um, you know, just especially with the teams we got coming up. Uh, you know, we're going to have to put some runs up.